we're back with our final member of oh wait Magic Squares Bruticus Blast Off. I forgot the name. Oh yeah, I got those instructions right here. If they're even on here. Uh, space shuttle. I'm not kidding. They're legit. Space shuttle. <sighs> and he has all the parts we need for combination. All right. The instructions saying. Anyway. Here he is. He's good. Very good. Just an annoyance of how to transform the hands. That's it. Paint works good. Scott thinks good. It's blast off small. So he's got his pew pew bang bang. Simple as he pegs it in the hand. <laughs> he also has his hand, which is unique him in that way. And he comes with the legs. Now, all the other parts, the feet, those, the chest area, and those back covers you get with the others can be put together into somewhat of a base mode with Rick's his head is just chilling right there. Bit different, considering that the last two we got the trailer for Motor Master and the drill tank for the D Devastator. Right? So back to this guy. He's good. Pretty big. Ball jointed head. But if you're not careful, you force the chest for Ball joints, and the shoulder, and an elbow, swivel. There is a little joint in here if you can see that pin. Slightly, but it's not really important. And the hands on the ball joint, that's limited because of the covers. There is a hab. Jesus. Waist roll. There is no hip skirts that I can see, but some forward on the back can flip up. There's no back in and out. Swivel. There is a double knee and a pivot and a bit of a toe. But <laughs> so yeah, decently posable. Now transformation wise, this is fun. So we'll do the torso area first. So what you want to do if you can see that seam line there, you have to separate it to get out. Now, when I started there, I do it. It was impossible there. So you do that, and then you fold this out. At the same time you're doing this, this hand flips in. So you can just swap it around and in like that, and that closes up. Nice, nice. But yeah, I was very scared I was going to break this guy when I was doing that. All right, next you wanna, if you see right there behind that, you have to line that, peg it into there. You have to rotate this out section here, like so, so that, oh wait, nope, I did it wrong. There we go. <laughs> so it looks like that, so pretty much this section, full 180. So then you can then peg in like that. And just flip it out like that. That's that done. Next, get the head and flip it out of the way. At the same time, pulling the sides out of the way. So you can now explode his torso and flip everything out. First. There's a panel in here you want to flip up, which has the head onto it. In here, there's another panel. Flip out, flip out again, and flip. Landing gear out, then this whole back section you need to flip that out, then this out. There's some little panels right here. This. Oh, come on. There it is. There's little panels flip out right here, and then you can rotate this entire thing around. Collapse it and tab it into place. And that collapse it out. And now you pretty much just collapse everything back and make it look like the front of a space shuttle. Like. So, so these arms pegged together. 
This part comes down and just slots in there, holding it all into place. Oh, that's right. This has an annoying thing of... You have to do the arms last. That flips up. Right. Yes. That up, that up. The arms back together. Tab. Add all in and then tab. This all together. And there's our cop area. There Actually, let's get this panel back here and flip out the tabs. Like so. And we'll do that one last because we gotta do the legs, which are really cool. So you wanna flip the wing down and this purple panel, you wanna flip forward, don't tab it in. Because now we have to do this area. So we'll flip this out of the way so you can then about the thruster and rotate the thrust this thruster completely around like so and then the whole leg will come apart so this panel this is a panel you want to untab so you can then extend it out and it comes floopy so yeah you flip the top here down and there's a panel you want to flip out Put back down for unfolding that panel. And just put the leg back into place for the moment. So you can then start collapsing everything back into place. <laughs> oh, whoops, I forgot a panel. There's this little panel area here you want to flip out as well. <laughs> right, we'll flip the thrusters back around. Wings will be fine. We'll flip the purple power up and it will slot in there. So, then this top section here will now peg into the sides. And that power fold out down here, it will fold out as well a couple times. And then we'll peg into the wing and up here. Making it look very complete. And now the other side, just to get a benefit of flipping out the tail fin. <laughs> so I'll quickly get that done. But yeah, this is a very good so far. And next we do a combination after this. It's gonna be great. Do, 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 do. And thankfully, it's not like the pain like Swindle has been for me. You'll see why Swindle is still a bit of a pain for me in combination mode. Alright, it's all done. Turn that back in for now. Alright, so. Put the legs together for this next part. Everything will tab together. Just quickly tab everything that needs to be tabbed in to each other. Last one, this panel will now just fold in and just complete the look. 
And there is his shuttle mode. And it is very good. A bit finicky with the legs and stuff, but it's easy to manage. You can't put the gun into the hole. Right there. It looks stupid. <laughs> yeah, pretty good. And now that's pretty much it. Next is combination mode. And I'll do a combine mode for this guy then, because it makes it more interesting. See you then. Bye.